everybody, it's Christine the Haunt Girl. Today I am talking about the Curious Elevator of Mr. Hinks. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications so you don't miss any upcoming escape room reviews, haunted trash walk those or anything else of the sort I do here on the channel. And if you're already a subscriber, thanks so much for supporting the channel. It really helps me out. All right, this is a play at home game by Bluefish. I really liked this game. Uh, it was it was really fun and an interesting way to do an escape room. It comes in a box. They send you pretty much everything you need aside from your internet device and connection. Uh, even a pencil here, which is great. And they made it so it doesn't get all messed up and roll around. They actually put it like in a little like um, clip on the box, which I thought was awesome. Um, this is a fun, really interesting game where you will use your internet to access the website and then put in the answers at which then you will be able to move from floor to floor of this building in order to reach your final destination. Um, there's a lot of floors in this building. Just be aware. I, I really thought the puzzles were well done in this. Um, I love the props. There's these great little props like this business card, which is just super cute and well done and very good card stock. There are postcards that are very postcardy on really good card stock. I loved this. I'm so silly, but I loved this paper being the old printer paper. I don't know. It just brought me joy. I was like, oh, it's reminiscing here of this old time of my past with printer paper. Um, just like I said, really nice, solid props. The newsprint is on newsprint, which is awesome. Uh, there's this book, little bound book with what you need in it. Um, I, I liked it. I liked the game. I liked all of the things to do. There's a lot of things to do. There's a lot of puzzles. There's a lot of puzzles. Take good notes. One of my favorite things that stood out about this game was the refill envelope. Uh, one of the things that is such a bummer about playing at home games like this is that you could just destroy the game. You play it once. You can never play it again. If maybe you're you know, parents or your siblings or your spouse or your date was like, man, I wish I could have played that. You can't be like, well, here you go. You can play it now. Nope. It's done. But they give you a refill envelope so you can actually play it a few times if you don't destroy the pieces yourself. Uh, I thought that was just such a cool option. So you do have a small replayability, but you personally wouldn't replay it because you've already played it, but someone else in your family or one of your friends could. It's it's really fun. It's very well done. If you're a puzzle person, I think you really like this. Uh, there is story that goes along with it, but like I said, it's more of a puzzle game. In that sense, I think puzzle people are just going to appreciate this so much. Uh, I wanna thank Bluefish Games for sending it to me so I could play it, check it out. I hope that you all check it out. Um, I, I just, I think it's just very, very well done, creative, unique, very puzzle heavy, and, and just a good time. And you know, right now, in the middle of a pandemic in this world that we live in, we need some good times. So go check out their website in the description below, order yourself the game, have some fun with your friends and family uh, from home, and uh, yeah. And check out my blog, thehonkgirl.com. All right. Uh, more Halloween stuff to come as October is approaching. I'm very excited about that. Uh, more at-home game reviews if you want to see any of that. I have just posted a list of SoCal haunts and other Halloween attractions and things like pumpkin patches and stuff on my blog, thehauntgirl.com, along with my schedule of upcoming haunts that I'm going to. And also, uh, I will be posting this review over there as well. So make sure you go check it out at thehauntgirl.com. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.